What's up guys, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we'll be discussing what is HEIF or what is HEIC format and what you should do to actually view those images in your Windows computer. So what is HEIC or HEIF? HEIF stands for High Efficiency Image Format and uses the codec called HEIC, High Efficiency Image Codec. And this is a new codec that has been developed by MPEG Group or MPEG Group but was launched by Apple with iOS 11 that is actually way better than JPEG. It actually records high quality images with more information, more metadata, uh, but with reduced file size. So that means you can actually get more images stored on your computer, on your phone with more details, more image quality, but with reduced file size, reduced, uh, reduced memory. But this technology comes with some limitation and the limitation is that on uh, on older computers or old um, old phones the format is not yet supported and you will have to upgrade your system one of the victims is like me i have an i have an old computer so this is why uh, you know these images are actually not displaying on my windows computer so we'll be fixing that in this video so let me set up my computer and i'll walk you through how you can view the images heic uh, photos on your windows computer this is my windows computer and i do have like six images on my computer and these are all in heic format and that's the extension right there and you can see uh, i can't even see the thumbnail on the on the images and uh, let's try to open one of the images and and see and as you can see uh, the image is not being displayed and it does give you a message that you need to install some additional codecs to work with this file oh by the way i do have like a k light mega pack installed in my computer so i do have my codecs in, um, updated but this is something new for my you know six years old computer so that that is why it's not able to handle this new codec so let's try to see what happens if we click on that link. It opens your Microsoft App Store and it asks you to install HEVC video extension that would, that would be able to play your HEVC or HEIC image codecs and video codecs. However, this is not currently free. This is for all like 99 cents. And the reviews are pretty bad, two stars out of 186 ratings so i'm not gonna bother paying you know even a dollar when the product is actually not that high rated instead i'm going to suggest you a tool a free tool actually that you can install on a computer it's called heic copy trans for windows and it's free for personal use as you can see it's right there free for personal use and this tool is actually pretty good it uh, it actually lets you even see the thumbnails of images you know of HEIC and, uh, and also open the images on your Windows computer. So let's proceed and download, those, download the setup. I already have the setup downloaded on, um, onto my computer, so let me try to open that. Copy trans right there. So let me double click. So it's a setup wizard, so click next and install it onto your computer. And um, so it's actually free for personal use. And if you're using for business purpose, then uh, please, um, you know, it's not a free tool in that case. But if you are using for personal, then yeah, click that box and uh, click next and install it onto your computer. All right, and back to my original folder. And instantly you can see that the thumbnails are uh, visible on uh, of the HEIC images. So let's refresh and uh, let's try to open the images again with the same photo app that I was using earlier. Uh, I did give you a preview uh, not loading properly. How about if we load these into the photos viewer? So open with Windows Photo Viewer. And yeah, they load properly now. So HEIC images are loading properly onto your Windows computer. Uh, these are all the images that I shot today with my phone. So um, yeah, the Photos app did give me some problem. Maybe you know it was my computer. Maybe it works on your computer. But if it doesn't, then you can still use your Photo Viewer to view these HEIC images on your Windows computer. And this is pretty much it from this video. I hope this video was useful for you and if it was, hit the like button and subscribe to my channel because in my next video, I'll be sharing how to convert these HEIC images into JPEGs. So I'll be sharing a couple of ways how to do that. 
and I'll see you in my next video.